I want to show you how they battle first. You ready? It's crazy, dude. I love that thing, bro. Oh, oh, oh. What is going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. And I just want to remind you guys before we hop into it about the giveaway Marineland five gallon tank right here. We're giving this away at 50,000 subscribers. In order to enter, you got to be a subscriber. You gotta follow us on Instagram, and go ahead and drop a comment down below. Uh, we saw a lot of new faces down in the comments. We love that. So go down, drop a comment, be a subscriber, go check us out on Instagram for a chance to win this tank. It's a great tank. But um, hopefully we get to 50K soon so we can give it away and then do another giveaway. So in today's video, we do actually have a little bit of bad news regarding this tank, which we will talk about later in the video. But of course, we gotta keep it real with you guys. You guys are coming along this journey with us. So let's just hop right into the video. Well, you're on camera now. A little soccer action before we feed. You already know. You know how we let's go, we're going the up. Sidekick, dude. Okay. You are not good, dude. You are not looking good right now. Hang on. Let's go, last try. It's got to go in that net. You get 10 points. In the net? Over no, over over with, with the thing. You can't do it, can you? You can't do it, dude. Are you serious? On it? Yep. Get another request. Hair out of face. Lefty snipe. Oh, oh, no. That's gone. That's Duke's ball. We won't tell Duke. <laughs> that, that is out of the... Yard! Yeah. Duke, Duke's okay. ball's gone. There's the other one, guys. Don't worry, Duke still has his ball. It's a little dusk. This is when the fish really get fired up. It's definitely mosquitoes out here, so we turn, put these on. No mosquitoes. Fire. Guys, look at our gar. He knows where we feed him. First one up right there. Disguises himself as a log. Like a savage. Like and he will savage. bite your finger off, I'm telling you. Just he almost bites me every time I feed. There he is. If I even do that, boom. Faked him out there. That's right, buddy. Exactly. That's right. Don't be so mad. Everything's fired up. Recently, these guys have been really, really fun to feed and really, you know, having a good time. Three, two, one. Oh, you missed. Oh, oh get the out of there. Go. Him. Go. I mean, go. Move. Him. Move. Go. Get out of there, buddy. Oh, did he get it? Distract him. Yeah, distract. Okay, good. Oh. Far from blew it up. Let's go. Got a fart. Fair enough, guys. Oh, do what you gotta do. Gar's still getting chased. Wow. Can I try to hand feed the tarpon, please? Let me try to hand feed the tarpon. Grace. Well, I didn't get that. <laughs> Look at Chris. He's the biggest girl. Oh, I'm not putting my hand in there, dude. Get him. Jeremy's getting the whole way. He's on the back <laughs> Chris, get you gotta it, get, get in here, dude. Get it, Jack. Jeremy ate the whole thing. Jeremy ate the whole thing. Jimmy, it's the whole thing. <laughs> Jimmy, it's the whole thing. Jimmy, it's the whole thing. It's the whole thing. Oh my god, it's savage, dude. <laughs> That's dude, why you don't throw Tommy at me. I, I just want a little piece. Look how big that play was. <laughs> dude, oh, why do you have to hold it like a girl, man? It's gonna be full tonight. Oh, bastard, I got scared. He ate it. <laughs> Yeah, he's bit my hand before, guys. It's not fun. Yeah. No way Jeremy eats again, right? No shot. No dude. shot that fish eats. That again. was a whole freaking fillet. That was the entire fillet. He ate the whole thing. It was hanging out of his mouth. I love that fish. They're, they're being really cool tonight. Come guys. on. Savage. All right, guys. We love our fish and we love our torch, so we don't get eaten by mosquitoes. They were fired up today. Jerry ate a whole fillet. That fish is gonna get huge. I can't wait till Willie, our one-eyed platinum red tail catfish, gets that big so we can put him in the pot. Let's go back to the tank room and talk some more. Nice wahoo for the boys. Treat him right. That's what happens when you catch fish, a lot of fish. Fish are eating good. Fish are eating good. Eat, good. Eat some nice wahoo. You know, me and Jack went out. We could slay about ten of them. We're gonna give our shark and eel some big grub today and our grouper. But big first. Grub. We gotta talk about something. All right, guys, if we take a quick glance at the tank. Fired up. They're fired, They're fired up, but we got some bad news. Clearly the tank looks a little empty. We've lost some members to the fam. We're missing the clown trigger, the emperor angel, and Puff Daddy, our beautiful dog face puffer. These things were wiped out from a disease called ick that just turned into something that not even the fish store knew at Barry Reef, the professionals, and uh, we spent hundreds of dollars on 
treatment to try to save these fish. These are the only survivors that we had. The strong survive, and sure enough, we got a shark and eel and a grouper. But we bathed these fish. We gave them freshwater bass. They said if it's ick in the beginning stages, we gave them freshwater bass for five minutes each, put them back in. That didn't do anything. We spent probably a good $150 on ick attack. Oil Since bass. it's such a big tank, you need more and more ick attack to treat it. So we went through bottles. Then we got this little tiny jar. A poly lab. Yes, it's called poly lab. lab. It was supposed to do the job, kill everything. And it got better. It yes. did get better. It did. It, it got did. better and it came back in full force. What happened was our, when we got our clown trigger, when we looked back on our videos, to begin with, the clown trigger is covered in white spots and yellow spots and blue. And you get distracted, you look at its beauty, you can't even, you're not gonna inspect the fish. You're just looking at it, wow, thing's beautiful. The fish, I asked the guy at the store, everything looks healthy, and sure enough, that fish had ick, it spread it, and uh, we did our best to save the fish, but the emperor, the, the clown trigger went down first, then the emperor angel. The puffer did survive in our tank, we took it to barrier. Since we wanted to treat our tank with copper, but since we have a shark, can't do copper, he's gonna die. So we, we took him there, they treated him with copper, and he died maybe a week later or so, I don't really remember, it was kind of just a tough time. Clearly it was, a, tank, it was pretty bad. That happens when you have fish. It's part of the hobby. You just gotta be careful and we did everything right. We literally strictly followed everything they said. We fed them this bacteria, we put gar garlic in the water, we tried literally everything. We turned up the tank to 82, we did water change, gravel vacuum, and sometimes you just can't beat it. Exactly. But Enough talking about that, let's get to feeding. At least these guys are totally okay. Not one spot on them. It's been a couple weeks without these fish. Everything's perfectly fine, we love them, so. These are our heart and soul right here. Don't you ever leave me. I love you so much. Don't ever leave me. I love this, I love this fish. All right, but we're gonna show you guys how savage, oh, I got some scroll on my camera. How savage these things are. You haven't seen them eat in a while. And I wanted to show you how the shark, has been, he's been getting a lot more comfortable in this tank. He's getting frisky with the eel. Oh, They're fine. Yeah. I want to show you how they battle for some you food. Ready? So, shark versus eel, let's battle for some food. Here we go. Round one. Here goes the food. One after another. Grouper yeah. wins. Grouper's going to get it first. Here we go. Grouper again. And again. Oh, the eel might have a chance at that one. Once the shark eel smells it, once the shark smells it, he will come out Here comes and he eel. will do some battling. Yes. Sir. Eel, little, you know, can't see very well. Nope. But uh, he, he finds it. Sense of smell. He finds it with a smell. Once this guy, I want to see his reaction once he starts smelling it. Oh. oh. Oh yeah, yeah. He's, he's fired up now. Like, Where's that ammo? Here we go. Oh, 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 oh. See, little little action there. Not, action. not much. Little round one. But once that shark gets uh, really used to. Yeah, once he smells it, he's really gonna gets smell on it scent. on the eel's um mouth, mouth there. Yeah. He gets. That shark's sure hungry, bro. Yes, he is. Look at him. That's our shark. Here, we have bro. a shark in our tank. Here we go. Move here. Hey. Damn it. Oh, see, see, little nippage. Little nip action there. Here we go. Now they battle. Oh, oh, oh the shark is not happy. The shark does not get happy when he it's finds one. It's cool because yeah. we know that the shark has such tough skin. He ain't. He's not. They're not going to do anything. Exactly. They're not going to harm each other. See, look. You know they they're battling right now. Yeah, they are. And the sh the eel tries to bite him, but first to the food. Battle to the food, man. Battle to the food. See, yeah. See that he went after his tail. Here we go. Here we. Oh, who's going to get that one? Who's going to get that one? That's a nice piece. Rupert. Here we go, more. Shark got it. Let's go. Let's go. See, I love when he gets him. It's like a victory because he's blind. Thing's blind as hell. <laughs> and uh, he can at least see a little bit, but his sense of smell is out of this world. He's a little all over the place. Great right again. Slurping, I love this fish. I love this fish, guys. But yes, they do battle. And uh, yeah, the shark will definitely grab those. But another announcement. So we haven't got a fish for this while. We wanted to not get fish. We wanted, you know, the egg to just. We know how the ick attaches to certain fish, but they haven't gotten it at all. So we're giving this tank a while to uh, recuperate, about a month, and then we're gonna, we actually bought a fish at the store the other day, but we didn't take it home, and it is the coolest fish I've ever seen. So you guys are gonna have to wait for that one, but by far the coolest saltwater predatory fish I've ever seen, and uh, you guys are gonna be stoked when you see this. Oh my God, look how big our platinum red tail is getting, guys. He's getting so big, he's ready for the pond. New pond, yep. by the way, stay tuned. In ground. In ground. It's gonna, it's gonna be, be dope. It's gonna be epic. It's gonna be epic. But we just wanted to really talk to you guys in this video about our saltwater tank and then update you guys on how it's doing. Be totally transparent with you guys because uh, it happens when you're in the hobby. It happens. But now you live and you learn. We've learned, and uh, well, that mistake will not happen again. Look at this guy, man. Yes, the noise got that. He got the prettiest platinum red tail. Yeah, I haven't seen a platinum red tail that looks like that. Every time I, look, I see them, they're usually yellowish with a yellow tint and literally. Piercing white. Completely white. And it's got one eye, dude. It's got one eye. Nothing's cooler than that. He's a pirate, man. 
One Eyed Willie, the freaking pirate. These things get like crazy. Dude, they've gotten so big. Yeah. Why do they poop every time? They, they literally eat? poop when they eat. Yeah. Look, look, this is what they do, guys. They stuff their face until they can't swallow anymore. Stuffed face. They're Stop. pigs. And look, he would. He was went after that one. Like he could eat it. Stuffed his face. So now we're gonna get the red tail ones. Now that we got big chunks. Those pieces now. Oh, oh, oh my God! I want to. No, he'll it. spit that. Yeah. Okay. Good. Good. Oh. Came back for it. it. He'll spit it. There's no way he can swallow that. No way. Let it go, man. Let it go. Your mouth's not big enough. Thank you, sir. No, no, leave it, leave it. Hey, hey, leave it alone. Hey, leave it alone. Hey. Really get it. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. That's our Here cleanup, that's our cleanup crew right there. Eat that one. Dirty. Turn down. Good. There you go, buddy. Arnold's doing well, as always. Pea Popper's doing well, as always. And, uh, oh, Daphne's gonna get another one. Yes. That's a huge jump, bro. Guys, they are completely battling right now. Look at this. You guys just missed it. They are searching. Oh, oh yeah. And look at them. Look at them. Before, it's usually way worse than this. They usually really go at it because they're they want to be first to that food. But look at these guys. They're on top of each other. They don't quit it for literally, they literally they're until they're, they're completely taking each other Let's Throw some more food in here. See who gets it first, boys. See the eel can see. The shark is totally like. He's tr no, he's totally blind, bro. Oh, shark's on it. Shark's on it. Come on, dude. You gotta dude, act faster. Yeah. No. Act faster, bro. Oh, oh see, a little snippet. Here we go, here we there go, we here go. we go. See that they fight over the food. The shark smells it on the eel's mouth, that's where the problem is. Look how beautiful this shark is, guys. I'm so happy we had we got that thing. We literally clutched out getting that thing. Out. Oh, oh, oh! You gotta calm it down, dude. Yeah, the food's over okay. there. Dude, that look how fat our eel is right now. Guys, I fed this thing live shrimp the other day, big ones. One, <laughs> one swallow and it's gone. Gone. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Look, dude, what do they think this is, bro? Yeah, oh, you got them both. That's good. Out of way, boys. Love feeding these guys. So, guys, that is it for today's video. Just want to remind you guys quickly about the giveaway. Go enter it for a chance to win this tank. But our three buddies in here are doing good. Shark, Eel, Gruber, they're all doing great. We're planning on leaving this tank alone for a while until we add some more fish to finally complete this tank. But uh, that's going to be it for today's video anyways. Everyone else is doing great. and hope to see you guys in the next video. We got great videos coming out. Summer is here, so we're gonna be pounding them out, pounding out some good ones. So stay tuned, you're not gonna wanna miss, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.